What's up guys, Charlie here. Now today I have a very special unboxing from Calif Collectibles. So let's get started. I ordered some stuff from Chalice Collectibles. This is a pre-order I made way back when. I don't even remember like the month or anything. Like that. Maybe January ish. It was before this whole lockdown thing. Uh, I paid, as you can see there, I paid $40.35 for this thing total. I think that's like after shipping and everything. But I am very excited for this because these are two pods that I pre ordered for Chalice. I'm not sure if you can still order these. I don't know if they are still available online with them or not. If you go to Chalice Collectibles, if you guys have ever uh, been on their website, you guys know that uh, sometimes they have bundles of pops that you guys can order. Uh, I ordered a Chase bundle. I got the Joker bundle. And this is the Joker, the Common, and the Chase Joker. Very, very happy to add these to the collection. I, uh, like I said, I paid like 30, 40 something after shipping or whatever. Yeah, I believe the bundle was 30, and then with the whole shipping and everything, it came out to 40, 35 or whatever it was on the box. Uh, which I didn't mind paying one because I know Chalice uh, ships their pops with um, their protectors and these are, yeah, they're not, these are pretty nice protectors, I like their protectors. And then two, I mean the price of the chases alone, even if it's a bad chase, can still be in the 20s, 30s range. And uh, the pop is like 10, so that alone, like even if this chase didn't go up like in a crazy amount of price, uh, for the two of them, like uh, it pretty much like it was a good deal, you know. It was not like there was other bundles with chases that were going for like hundreds of dollars or like 80 bucks or something like that. I don't know, like the Cora Chase and Common set was going for like 80 or 100 something. This one I thought was like a very reasonable price, especially because like the chase alone, I feel like at some point, even if it goes down in price, because right now it's selling for like hundreds, I don't know, like people are going crazy with the listing for this chase. At least on Mercari, I haven't checked like eBay or Amazon or anything like that, but on Mercari people are already charging like 70, 80 bucks for the chase alone, sometimes they go in the 100 range. People have been going crazy with prices on their car, I will say that. Like there are like that Medusa pop, some people are starting to charge 300, 500 bucks for it. Within the Funko app, it's still like under a hundred. So um, that's crazy to me. But yeah, like this chase is already going for like 70, 80 bucks. I don't think it's gonna stay there, but that's what people are selling it for. And like I said, even if it goes down in price, I'm pretty sure it's gonna stay in the 30s 20s range and this pop it's gonna you know worst case scenario it does like it's like 10 bucks so that's 30 so it already like you know pays for the price of the box so uh i didn't mind paying the 30 for the two pops because i mean the chase alone at some point i'm sure like if it goes on in price it's gonna cost 30 40 bucks and uh this way i get both of them for the price of the chase uh, this one, I'm not big on getting chases. This chase variant I really liked because it's very different from the regular pop. Um, the face, uh, the head sculpt is completely different from this pop. That's why I really, really wanted this chase. Not to mention, I'm a big Joker fan and I really enjoyed the movie. Like, I believe this is a Jack Nicholson, Jack Nicholson band Joker. I really enjoyed this, these old Batman movies, even though most people hate them, I enjoy them. I used to watch these a lot when I was a kid and I still enjoy them. So I don't, uh, so of course I jumped on these when I saw them on Chalice. 
I still gonna need I still need to buy the other ones that come with the say uh, with the set. I already ordered the specialty series um, poison ivy. She's a specialty series pop. I'm pretty sure we're not getting her in our store in my store because uh, my store doesn't get specialty series pops. So I actually pre-ordered her with Shumi. First time I ordered something from Shumi, but I've seen a lot of YouTubers speak very highly of Shumi. So, uh, of course, when I saw that they had specialty series pops, I pre-ordered her and I pre-ordered the Sasuke with Shumi. So at some point, they will get here. Uh, but for now, of course, I got the Joker with Chalice Collectibles. Now, uh, of course, these were shipped great. There is a bit of damage in the corner there of the box, that top corner over here, but uh, I don't mind, uh, it's not really anything big and I, everything else is absolutely fine, it's just this corner there that's a little dang up, but uh, I don't mind because everything else is fine, and I mean it's not really anything I plan on selling, there's the chase. There it is. Even like the box. I don't know. I've never seen this with other chases. But even the box is different. The box art on the chase and the common is completely different, which I thought was interesting. Correct me if I'm wrong. I've never. I don't remember seeing this ever on any other uh, chases before. Uh, but let me know if you guys have and if. You know, I just haven't looked at a lot of chases. I mean, usually I'm not very interested on chases because they tend to be very lazy. But this one I thought was very, very different. <laughs> I thought it was an amazing chase. The fact that the chase on the common are so different, I love. I also really enjoy glow in the dark uh, variant chases. So at some point, I am gonna try to get that. Aura. Hopefully I'll be able to get her at my Hot Topic. Uh, I don't know, it's gonna be hard. I don't know, maybe I'm gonna have to do that thing that other people do where they, um, they buy like 10 different common ones to try to get that chase. I don't know what I'm gonna do, but I really want that Legend of Korra chase, the glow in the dark. I love glow in the dark chases. And chases like this where it's like a big variant just because I feel like this is such a different chase We're gonna look at it right now. I also like these come with a backdrop as well Yes, Funko. I'm wondering if they're starting to do that and if, if they're gonna start doing that with all their pops It's really cool that those two have that. I don't know if I should move the boxes down. Let me put these a little more so Let's put these out I want to look at these up close because they are so so different so yeah the only thing that really changes is the head sculpt on these two which I don't mind because they are still amazing pops so here is the common there we are all the little details on like the code and everything the pants, everything is really nice. The paint job, there was a lot of room for error on this paint job, but the paint job is actually really, really nice. Absolutely love it. So that is the common version. There we are. Now this is the chase variant. Let's make it focus, yeah. So I like how the hat has a little shine to it. So that's interesting, it's almost metallic. There's the face. I really, really love this chase. And there's even like the hair color. See, the head sculpt is completely different. The only thing that's the same is the face itself, but the face paint is uh, different. Okay, so there they are again. So this is the chase, as you all know by now. Really, really nice. Really love the detail on him. There we are, really cool, like the texture on the hat too is really nice. And look at that 
paint job it is amazing like there are no flaws whatsoever and there was a lot of room for error on this paint job and there isn't there is the comment which looks just as beautiful on the paint job and everything there we are so cool i love this green as well that green is one of my favorite colors that's really nice the hat looks amazing little bow there everything looks absolutely great on these two pops really really love them there they are side by side really really amazing very very happy to add these two to the collection there we are guys very very happy again to add these two to the collection for the rest of the set i know uh, they have them available at gamestop right now i believe i saw them there i'm pretty sure uh hot topic is going to get them and box lunch as well i want to buy them off hot topic uh the specialty series poison ivy i have like i said pre-ordered with shumi so once hot topic gets uh releases all the other ones i'll be able to get them from there and therefore have the entire set of these new batman pops that i think are amazing very happy to add this chase to the collection this is probably one of my all-time favorite chases i think it might be my favorite chase actually besides that glow in the dark and that glow in the dark thing is really cool i'll get them eventually and I really want that Legend of Korra glow in the dark as I said before. Oh my god, I'm such a sucker for glow in the dark pops. But uh, this might still probably be my favorite chase just because it's so different from the common. Like this is not a lazy chase at all, as you guys can see. It is so so different. Like it's not something that they just added. Like in the beginning, I didn't even realize that the head sculpts were completely different when I ordered these at first. And then I kept looking at, I kept checking up on my order and kept seeing the picture of these two. And then I realized how different the two were, which actually made me fall in love with this chase even more. So I'm very, very happy to add this chase to the collection. Curious to see at what price point it stays in the future regardless i'm just happy i have them because like i said before i am a huge joker fan so i'm gonna add this to my joker collection i'm just gonna be chilling in the back there with my vanya and my five chases i also have a captain marvel chase but uh nobody cares about captain marvel at this point especially not the chase just because there's so many captain marvel pops but this one is so different and I absolutely love it you all, love it, very happy to add this to the collection. But anyways guys, that is it for today. Let me know if you guys were able to pick up this chase or if you guys are trying to pick up this chase. Absolutely worth it if you can, I mean try not to see i don't know i don't want to tell you guys to wait and then like have it shoot up in price just because i waited for like that medusa because i thought she was gonna go down in price and she shot up like crazy now i'm having a very hard time getting her she's getting into that gorilla status but yeah also because people are going crazy and just abusing people that are paying the 150 or whatever for her so now they're trying to pump up that price to 300 500 which i think is absolutely ridiculous Especially because in the Funko app, like I said, she was, last time I checked, she was going for 50, but, oh my god. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'm gonna stop rambling. That is it for today. Thank you very, very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. That's gonna be up there where that Majora's Mask is next to the Joe Chase Joker there. And go ahead and give this a thumbs up. Let me know what you guys thought. And uh, that way I know if you guys did you like the video or not. But anyways, thank you very much for watching guys. Stay safe as is always. If you go out, wear your protective stuff. At least, you know, right now. Because we're in this time of madness. 
as always guys thank you very very much for watching and uh have a good one stay safe and i'll see you guys next